Kilmer here of Alley in the Valley. I'm gonna make a really easy summer cocktail in my cocktail garden that I planted. I'm gonna make a strawberry jalapeno cocktail. I'm gonna pick these beautiful strawberries. Let me show you. Come closer. Let me show you. My strawberries I've been growing, my little beautiful tasty strawberries. I'll use some of these for garnishes. Um, and then let's get some mint. Let's go over here. Get some great mint. And let's get some basil. Now, let's go inside and make a strawberry jalapeno margarita. All right, you know how I love me some margaritas. So today, I'm just gonna make something, some stuff I had, which is strawberries, jalapeno, some lime, some tequila, some mugabe, bubbly water, salt to rim the glasses, and a little garnish of basil and mint. And we have the perfect summertime cocktail. Let's get started. So I'm just gonna, first things first, I'm gonna cut the tops off of some of these strawberries. And some of the strawberries I got from my garden, some I had bought at the store because um, I wanted strawberries. <laughs> And I had some leftovers. So what better way than take leftovers and make a cocktail? I can't think of a better way. So we're gonna use about a cup of strawberries. All right. All right, I'm gonna put all the strawberries in my little blender. That might be too many of them. Um, I am gonna do about an inch of the jalapeno. Now, if you don't want it super, super spicy, Put just a little bit in, but I like it spicy here at Alley in the Valley. Um, and I'm gonna leave the seeds in too. So I'm gonna do about, that's one inch, okay? I'm gonna test it from there so it's not too strong. Okay. Blend this, chop it up. So I got all my strawberries and my slice of a jalapeno, like one inch in here. I'm gonna eat one of the strawberries. Mm -hmm. Let's chop it up. If you don't have one of these pretty smart little grinders, you can always just muddle it in your um, cocktail shaker. All right, that's ready. I have ice already in my cocktail shaker. I'm just gonna pour these ingredients and I'm gonna add everything in here. So easy. I hope the summer has, um, well, it's been an interesting summer. It's been a much needed change out there. So let's drink to that. All right. All right, now we're gonna add our tequila. We're gonna do three, ounce, three to four ounces depending on how strong you want it, okay? I've already put a few in there. So, and then we are going to do two teaspoons of agave. You could also use honey. I'm just, you know, I don't measure here. Boom. All right. Let's shake it up, baby. 
Let's shake it up. I already have my ice in there. So my ice, stra muddled strawberries with a little jalapeno, agave. Let's do it. Oh, I forgot the most important part, my lime juice. <laughs> Sometimes when I'm taping, my brain goes doo -doo -doo -doo. Okay, so let's um, rim the glass first with lime juice so we can get our salt on there. And these are my new plastic cute glasses that I just got for outside, so we're not breaking my real glass glasses, which happens all the time when we're drinking by the pool or just having a cocktail outside, somebody kicks it over and it breaks. So, some cute plastic glasses. Everybody should invest in these. You can thank God the stores are open so you can go to Home Goods, get a few things. Okay, just make sure you wear your mask and your gloves. All right, now I need to put lime juice in. Now I'm gonna add the lime juice. I hope everybody's um, summer is off to a decent summer. Please wear your mask and your gloves if you're going out and keep social distancing. The numbers are still going up and we have to be conscious. So let's be conscious. Let's um, enjoy our homes and let's just go out as needed for right now. I know I'm ready to go crazy too. I have been to a couple extra stores but I wear my gloves and I wear my mask and I'm very conscious. So, okay, let's shake it up. <laughs> All right, let me get something to wet my hands with. All right, so I'm gonna do a little bit of a garnish with some jalapenos. I'm gonna garnish with jalapenos and little cute strawberries from my yard that I'm growing and some basil or some mint or whatever you have. So let's shake this up one more time and then we're gonna top it with bubbly water. So we have our muddled strawberry jalapenos. We have our tequila, three ounces to four ounces of tequila, agave and lime juice to your liking, but like a half a cup of lime juice. Shake it all up. And then we're gonna put some bubbly water on top. So this is more of a skinny margarita, a skinny strawberry jalapeno margarita because I don't have the contro in here or triple sec if you want it stronger. Oh my God, this is the bomb. Mm, bit, wait, I've outdone myself. I'm super excited, I can taste it. Okay, it's messy. messy but hey sometimes messy is good get every drop every drop all right I have made a big mess but it's looking fabulous right okay and we're gonna top off with some bubbly water just make sure the bubbly water doesn't go flying in my face <laughs> top off bubbly water and there you have, how easy is this strawberry? Let's put a jalapeno, you can cut it, let's do that. Jalapeno strawberry cocktail, perfect for summer. A little spice in your life. Strawberries from my garden. Strawberries from my garden. Um, and I'm gonna put a little basil in this one. A little basil topper, mm-hmm. A little basil topper, mm-hmm. And there you have a five-minute strawberry jalapeno margarita, skinny margarita on top of that. You know where to get the recipe, allyinthevalley.com, and let's taste this, baby. I need it. It's been a lot going on, and I'm praying, and I'm so proud of everyone out there fighting for what they believe in, and what's super important about change. Mm. 
I outdid myself here, I gotta say. Thank you for following Now in Valley. If you liked this video, hit the like button. Don't forget to follow me on all my social media and I hope you and your family are safe out in the world. Don't forget your mask and gloves. Strawberries from my yard. Mmm. I'll see you. Mmm, so good. On the next Alley in the Valley. Mmm. That's a bomb.